Hey guys, uh, I just wanted to make another video uh, before the rains come. But right now, uh, Ian uh, is just finishing up Florida. I guess it's going to work its way up inland or whatever. And I uh, feel bad for the guys down in Florida. Carl, I know you're on vacation in the U.S. What a way, what a way to be on vacation. What a time to be on vacation. Sorry to hear about, you know, just not having a good one. But um, I guess that's just the way it goes. So... Um, yeah, uh, again, I'm sorry, bud. Um, but we're, you know, we're going to kind of luck out because it's just going to be rain for the next three or four days. Um, I know this area in North Carolina sometimes gets hit, but um, uh, it looks like it's going to just be rain for us. As I go through this crazy four-way stopper but yeah again Carl I'm sorry to hear about your bad luck and everything uh, hopefully uh, there'll be a silver lining someplace who knows I, I, I don't really know what to say but um, but uh, yeah so I just wanted to get out and um, you know it's kind of cool today about 60 degrees right now uh, I'm not really dressed crazy I put a thermal on the top underneath my riding shirt you guys have seen my last video with the gear I wear but it's not bad. I'm just going to run this, do some errands. I just didn't feel like taking the car out. And uh, you know, what the heck? I'll just take the bike out because uh, I'll probably be, won't be riding for three or four days. Anyway, um, what I wanted to talk about is uh, riding and uh, what's your riding style. I, you know, as I jump on the bike, I have no idea what I'm going to talk about. I just turn the camera on and then it just pops into my head. And I know they're just... It's uh, probably boring most of the time, but whatever. So I'm interested in your riding style. Now, you guys see my riding style when we're talking. It's pretty much boring. Uh, you know, I don't, you know, there's some, I hit some turns and twisties, but nothing super crazy. You know, I don't do the big wheelies and stuff like that. So that's not a, I do ride aggressive though. That's just getting back to the type of riding style we do. I tend to ride aggressive. You guys just don't see it. Um, I'd like to do my blasts and sometimes I'll do that a lot you know I, I just like to get up to you know the top speed of the bike as fast as I can and I know it may not be the safest thing to do but you know what it's the thrill I like and uh, that's what I do so um, yeah uh, and um, you know what I'm just thinking uh, as I'm talking to you guys you know what I forgot my license my wallet my money but well, the first errand I'm going to, I don't need any of that, so I'll just have to shoot back and uh, and get that when I... Because I had kind of on the way back to my house anyway. Anyway, so getting back to it. So what is your riding style? Is it, you know, is it aggressive? Is it, um, is it, or just, you just, you have this type of bike, so you're just really interested in off-road, and when you're riding on-road, it's just kind of just chilling out, like, you know, you're riding a bag or a cruiser or something, you just chill, and you just kind of enjoy the scenery and... Um, enjoy the ride and uh it really you know you're not into the aggressive moves like this turning circle we're in right now i like to fly through this thing when i can because you can just lean it one way then lean it the other way and just snap it back and uh i kind of like that kind of riding you know and uh like i said i don't do it a lot on the on the camera or when i'm doing the videos i don't it's not that i don't you know i'm not worried about getting a ticket or all that stuff if the law comes after me I, i'm not worried about all that bullshit and i'm not really concerned that i'm setting a bad example for some like one guy was you know yo you take your hands off and you know you're always you know you got to keep both both what you call uh, hands on the, on the on the handlebars well you know it's the way i ride you know i don't preach to people how to live their life don't preach to me how to live mine so you know it doesn't that doesn't i just you know i just tend to ride calm when i'm calmer when i'm doing the videos but when i'm not and if i'm with friends you know one or two guys we we get to be a little bit of a hooligan so so th that's my question is you guys um like to ride just cruise you get aggressive you like to go fast you like to hit the twisties i just be curious you know i mean like i said i i have i just you guys are tagging along my, my famous line and uh you just happen to be watching the video if you're bored or something and and, and I, I just talk about stuff like this because i'm just curious what goes through other riders heads you know and um is it just somebody some guys i know it's just it's just transportation you know and that's it but others most of the people have a bike because they want to have fun on it uh what whether it's just cruising down the highway at a, at a you know at a, a normal speed or flying or going off road uh, I don't know what it is uh, what it, what the majority is because it's YouTube has so many different um, 
uh, how do I go? It's just so many different things you can do with a motorcycle, and everybody has their specialty. Some guys just want to be off-road, and they have a, a, a kind of a bike that's more off-road than 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 most, and uh, you know than uh, than on-road. But and they don't mind. They don't mind um, uh, suffering for the. Okay, I think my street's coming up soon. Nope, not yet. And. Um, and I'll come back back on and we'll talk more about this but some some riders uh, you know that's they don't care about you know if it's a little uncomfortable on a highway because their main thing is they just can't wait to get to the dirt you know and me I, I gotta have like I, I think I've talked about this before I gotta have it all you know I, I just gotta have it all I want sportiness I want um, uh, I, I just want it all so here I'm coming into my uh, uh, where I store some of my stuff because guys I don't talk about it much but I still haven't found a place but uh, yeah I'll be back in a little bit just hang on guys okay guys we're just doing a um, just a narration because I didn't plug my mic in so I'm just going to make this quick u-turn uh, I like practicing these u-turns it, it's about 18 feet and uh, I always like to do these from a dead stop see how good I am sometimes I do it good sometimes I don't but it's kind of fun. Anyway, uh, you'll catch up with me in a minute. I'll speed this video up and then we'll uh, show me putting my mic on as I'm riding or clipping my, or plugging my mic in, which I probably wouldn't suggest anybody do it, but uh, I, I've done it many times, so it's not, it's not a big deal. But uh, for some reason, I just forgot to plug the mic in. All right, guys. Um, I'm back after a quick speed up, and as you can see, I'm fiddling with the mic. I put the cruise control on, and uh, yeah, <laughs> not pretty easy to do. All right, guys, I don't recommend doing that. As you guys can see, I didn't have my mic on because uh, you had a kind of a. I just did that little U-turn in the in the um, storage facility, and. Uh, I just looked down as I drove away for about a mile. I had the mic. I didn't put. I didn't plug my mic in. So yeah. Um, okay. Got a little. Uh, I don't know what that was on the road, but it looks like it's just a leaf. And uh, yeah. And uh, so yeah. So I like practicing U turns. What do you guys think I, when you heard dead silence doing my U turn? Um, I think it was about uh, less than 18 feet, which is kind of cool. And um, I like practicing doing the the U turns from a dead stop, and you know. Because in case you're, you know, in case you're stuck in a situation, you don't want to look like a goofball. And uh, this bike makes it so much easier. I don't know. You know, it's all technique, yes. But th this bike makes it easier. This bike is like you're on training wheels. It's, it's got such a, a sweet handlebar sweep from one side to the other. It's so well balanced. It's really, really easy to, to, to make, a, uh, make U turns with this thing and tight maneuvers. And, you know, as we were talking about, uh, you know, what do you like to do with, you know, do you like to do technical stuff with the bike? You know, um, um, I, I like to do technical stuff with the bike. And not that, like, you know, I'm going some place to do it. I mean, I just do it on my own and I just kind of picked out the parking lots and go through cones and that kind of stuff. So, yeah, uh, I like it. And, uh, but, uh, okay, let me just get through this before I kill myself. And, uh, yeah, so, you know, I kind of like um, doing the technical stuff, the slow stuff, just to give, you know, just to give me that feel of, of, of control of the bike, which is kind of cool. And um, I just can't believe I didn't plug my mic in. I guess I don't, it, I, I wouldn't, I put the cruise control on, oh, that, that gentleman that, oops, we got something going on over here. I put that cruise control on and I uh, don't know what he's doing, but that's okay. And uh, put the plug the mic in. That's how well balanced this bike is. It's just it's not me, folks. It's the bike. So uh, yeah. So what do you guys? Um, uh, throwing garbage. Unbelievable. So what do you guys? So what's your riding style? You just like to cruise? You just like to relax? Do you get aggressive? Uh, do you like to be a hooligan? All of the above. Uh, you just want to be off road because this is the type of bike we have. You know because it's it's it lends itself to that. Um, I don't know. I'd like to know. That's what I would like to know. And as I, I forgot my wallet, so now I got to go back home, then run back out. I got to run to the post office. Not a big deal. Uh, not a big deal at all. See, 
that's a nice turn. I, I think I've hit that turn about 90, but uh, sometimes I have reservations of doing it. I'm, my biggest fear when, I tell you, I know guys when you're riding, maybe this is off subject, off topic a little bit when you're riding, is, uh, believe it or not, I think I would rather be with his, with his, uh, sorry about that. I think I would rather be a place where there's more traffic or the roads are busier because when you're riding down these roads the biggest thing you got to worry about is deer and they're they're going to come out from nowhere and you're done so i know it might sound backwards in a way or but i think you're really safer where there's traffic you know not like tons of traffic well tons of traffic you're really safe because you can't drive fast but um, I think you know what I mean. It's just, um, I think I'll go this way because I got to go back uh, to the house. Um, yeah, the wheelie control kicked in, folks. You don't, it, you can't really see it, but it pops up a little bit, but it's not a big deal. Uh, so yeah, so traffic, uh, so like a road like this, I, I probably won't worry it as much, even though this tree's here, there's a lot of houses, but when you're doing on a road that's dead and there's no homes or anything like that, that's where you, I think you got to be careful. So when I'm not feeling uh, safety-like, I do stupid things. But then I think about it, and then I say, you know what? Maybe let's just back off this time. I, I know it's weird, it's a, and it's very inconsistent for me. I, I'm not consistent at all. I'm always. Sometimes I feel like being just crazy hooligan. Other times I say, you know what, I just want to enjoy the scenery. But uh, yeah, so guys, that's basically it. I, I, it's not a long video again. I just wanted to get a video out before the rain start coming. And I'm just curious to see what you guys, what's your riding style? What do you like to do? Uh, whatever, whatever bike you have, it doesn't really matter because you can do anything with most any bike, pretty much anything anyway. So just let me know, let me know guys, what you guys think. And uh, I'll be back in a couple of days and making some other stupid video. Later.